Who hate their future, Andy. Today was a uh, pretty, pretty thankful day. You know, bad and good. Today you studied all day for a final. I think I'm pretty well prepared for my networking final. I did a lot of, you know, studying. My friends gave me a lot of resources to look at. I got a lot of help from my friends. Yeah, things are good. I've crammed a lot as much as I could in my head. My final starts at one and ends at sorry twelve ends at three. But the professor said that we have one hour to the final, so I can actually start at 1.50. But I need to sleep early right now because, I, you know, you have to get up, you know, recalibrate your mind, try to recall information, and set up your, your computer for all that stuff. So, yeah, that's good news. Let's move on to the good slash bad news. So, I got a C on my fine. I got a C. I, I passed the class, but, you know, I'm pretty upset with my letter grade. I wanted a C plus or higher, but, you know... Oh, whoops, it is what it is. As you see here, my final exam, I did a 21 out of 50, so I technically failed the final, which is not a good feeling, especially, you know, when you studied maybe three days, and three, no matter how much studying I did, I looking back at it, I don't think I would have been able to change the outcome. But it is what it is, you know. Um, I did slack off on the, this, like, maybe the last uh, week, and then I spent three days cramming and trying to, you know, get my, my act together. And you know things didn't work out. Hopefully, you know taking taking getting a near miss in this course will teach you a lesson because the professor actually said you needed fifty percent to pass this course for weighted average. But luckily, he emailed me at around two a.m. He's like, "Well, Andy, I'll give you a a a near pass since you since you've worked hard <laughs> and work hard." I did. And so yeah, I finally finished my assignments, uh, you know, things are all good. I have one more final left tomorrow, and also, I also did pretty well on a different course though, my project course, I got my letter grade, I did pretty good. I'm not, I guess I'm a little disappointed in myself, because I didn't do as well as I thought, but don't be too harsh on yourself, this was a, you know, a very important group project course, and um, I think what brought your mark down was taking a, a bit of an L on the, uh, where was it? Taking a bit of L on the quizzes and losing a lot of marks on your, uh, your one, one exercise over here. I got to get a 10 for that one. But it is what it is, Andy. You did what you can, you did with your best. Don't beat yourself up over it. You did good. So smile, keep moving forward and let this be a, you know, another harsh lesson to you. Even though you're almost graduating, you know, you still don't want to lose vigilance, you know, even though employers don't really care about your school marks, you, you care about trying to become a good student because good student means you can learn better, learn other things better and not get as distracted easily. And ever since quarantine started, I've been a lousy student. Like, I just, I miss going to the library, I miss going to school and all these things. But anyways, the course is a really good course. You know, she, professor made it as flexible led as it is for us. And yeah, uh, I got two of my letter grades. There's one more left to go. And I hopefully tomorrow's exam will be a, um, not too hard. I did study a lot, but I wouldn't say I understand the concepts 100%. I get the high level details, but hopefully it's enough for me to get by. I also downloaded all the uh, quiz practice questions, so I, I, I memorized most of the answers and understood somehow some of the mechanics work behind the answers. So hopefully the networking exam tomorrow should be a little easier. But yeah, good job. You. This is probably the craziest clutch you ever had in your life because a professor sent me an email and so I never had that before and I was like, whoa. I passed. I thought I was going to fail, but I passed. So yeah, always have your mind positive. A positive mind will help you keep going forward. But you did, you did whatever you could, Future Andy. Let's hopefully tomorrow's final should be a lot better. I'm kind of rambling at this point. It's getting kind of late. I'll, uh, I'll talk to you later. You did pretty good, so I won't give you shit for that. <laughs> Hopefully when, when winter starts, I can start applying for my resume to my jobs. I start working out again because I lost all my muscle I gained when now over the break. And hopefully I can start working out again. Um, yeah, I don't have much to say. Stay strong, stay vigilant, 
believe in yourself don't give up Just keep up the good habits and yeah you got this i believe in you it's getting late it's 4 30 i gotta wake up at 11 tomorrow seven hours of sleep should be good enough anyways adios good night stay strong love you good night